I'm Tim Baumgartner, and this is the Freedom Flyer. Welcome to my cab. I was in uh, the Army, Vietnam. Towing service is kind of a lot like the military. The military is always sitting around, the tow trucks are always sitting around, we're sitting in coffee shops, you're doing something. But when you, when the, you know, the rubber meets the road, when somebody really needs something done, it's important, who do they call? They call the military out to do the dirty work, and hey, they call us out to do the dirty work. We had the stars, the blue flames in it with the white stars with the red trim. We come across right up here into the Freedom Flyer with the eagle in the mountains. The thing that's very important to remember is freedom is not free. We represent World War I. We come all the way up to the present day, which is 9-11. Got Vietnam. Okay, being in a family business, you kind of are all on the same operating page anyway. We're all basically working for the same goal. And eventually when I kick the bucket anyway, the kids are gonna take over anyway. So they've been with me for 12 years now. Right after being born all the way to now, they've been a tow truck driver riding around. <laughs> Eagle, perfect representative of the United States. Pretty well the whole back and everything's all diamond plate aluminum. I'd say Volvo's probably by far superior on safety. When we roll onto an accident scene, you can just literally, when you get on the accident scene on head-ons or anything, you can just tell the difference in the world between how they're made versus how other trucks are made. And it's, it's not even a comparison. No matter where we go, I can be anywhere in the country and I'll have people call me up and say, is that you driving that or one of your drivers? We do a lot of parades, like we'll be in the 4th of July parade this year. We've, had, we've been asked to do four different parades this year for the 4th of July. Are you just getting off work? Yeah, just got done moving a great big humongous building and everything else. So we've been at it since one o'clock this morning. The veterans, you know, reflect back, oh, wow, hey, that's really cool. Other people just happen to catch the paint job 10 years down the road. Oh yeah, I remember seeing that truck down the road or whatever. No, I got 1.2 million miles on this truck. Just, it's just a class ride. And then uh, going right into there, you go into the World War II airplane, back into remembering 911 with the M16 into the boots, and back into the World War I again. So pretty well covers it in, and then goes right back up into the Freedom Flyer and the mountains and the Eagle again. This one here was, uh, First place in uh, Las Vegas at a tow show. This one was first place in uh, San Diego, California at another tow show. What's really neat is when we first pull into the shows, everybody's proud of their trucks. And then they see that paint job roll in, and then everybody goes, oh. <laughs> yeah, so they already know. They, you know, as soon as they see the paint job, they all go, is that really paint or is that graphics? No, that's really hand painted on there. And that's pretty well my truck all the way around from head to toe. Life on the edge is where I'm at. That's got to keep the speed moving, so. 